Hi, this is Natasha Copeland, and today I'm coming to you with my latest haul. Some of these I got on sale. You won't believe how much of a great sale I got on some of these things. So I was very happy to buy them at a discounted um, price. Plus, I've been away for a while. Just need a little me time. I had put myself on um, no buying restrictions. So I hadn't bought anything for a long while. So some of these have been out for a while. And when I started catching up, I spent a lot of money trying to catch up. So, <laughs> but I also got them at a great discount too. So that's probably what made me start buying again because I was trying to like let my income recover because I'm not really making anything off of these videos. So everything that I buy, I'm having to pay for. So when your money's not right, and that money is funny, you don't want to buy but like I said when I started back to buying I spent a lot of money so I can pat myself on the back for taking I think it was a two month hiatus from no buying a makeup for a while because I have so much I don't even use them all so I just had to do it and I did it and I think that um, for the month of June going forward for the next six months um i'm gonna try to limit myself to buying only two palettes a month and if i don't buy something like say for july that's two palettes but if i don't buy two palettes in july then comes um august i would then buy the two makeup items that i want for august well i'm gonna say that um i'm not gonna buy any eyeshadow except for two at a time per month everything else I will buy because I need everything else <laughs> so say that um for July is two is two um eyeshadow palettes but don't get it in July come August I get the August two um palettes plus the one from July so they roll over basically and that's how I'll do it for each month so I, I now know that I can sustain from buying I'm not buying crazy anymore so that should help me and curving this addiction to eyeshadow palettes because that's where my biggest passion is at is for the eyeshadows and it gets me every time and the more prettier the package the more it says Tasha come here get me you know you want me you know you want to add me to your collection and not being used eyeshadows and then I stupidly say, I agree with you. I really do. So that's what I'm going to do for the next six months. Two palettes. every Only two eyeshadow palettes every um, every month. If not, it rolls over to the next month and then over to the next month. And that's probably what I end up doing because it's going to start after this month. Because I got more makeup coming in um, this week, I do believe. So it will start after this month. <laughs> so <laughs> I hope to follow my own rules because my mom always said if you're lying to yourself you're playing out lying you're a liar even if you're lying to yourself so I'm gonna hold try to hold no I'm not gonna try to hold to I'm going to do it unless I can get someone else to buy it for me as a gift all right so let me start so I picked up this Pat McGrath which is um this is a uh, this has been out for some time and this is the, let me see, what is the name of this bad boy? Um, I shall palette, um, I don't see a name. Ooh, I do not know the name of this palette. Maybe it's right here and I just can't see it. Oh, Mothership Six, Midnight Sun. So let's open this bag girl up and believe it or not this goes for $125 I got it for $92 very proud of myself so let's see here and this is what it looks like isn't that pretty that is so gorgeous Especially this purple. 
I'm liking that. All right. So this palette has also been out for a while. It's the Amorizi by H by A B um H. So I was really wanted to try it because I tend to get all of her packages. I mean all her eyeshadow palettes now. So I still gotta get the last one that just came out, the one with her daughter. The four number four one. The Norvina uh, palette four. Alright, so this is the Amorizi. Nice packet. And the glitter doesn't come off on your hands either. Very good. They thought that through. And this is what this palette looks like. Isn't that pretty? I like the gold glitter. And this one was 45 I think. $45? I'm not for sure, but I got her on sale also. So it was 10% off of $45 or $49. Take 10% off, then you know how much I paid for it. And then I picked up this one also. The Arena one by ABH. But, um, I like this one. Isn't that so pretty? Look at that. Gorgeous. I picked up the Natasha Denona. $65 for her as well. And I got her for 10% off. Now, trust and believe. I had to shop at different stores to get these different prices because there was a bunch of sales going on. This is what I picked up. This is my third, well, my second large palette from Natasha Denona. And I have the um, Skinny Five, um, five of these. And I don't know how you would say it. I, don't, I almost want to say sample size, but it's five of her shadows that are in a long tube looking thing so this is my second larger one and this was $65 with 10% off so I stopped by Sephora and I picked up another um, bottle of the Brazilian Boom Boom um, cream and this was $45 and I got 10% off See how I get into this bad boy, bad girl, rather. I don't want to break my nails. Are they already been breaking off? Oh, really? Just gonna have to tear it open. I keep a bottle of this by my bed. Cause I like to put my um when I'm going someplace, I like to put the cream on while I'm sitting down on the bed. So I keep a big bottle by my bed at all times. And so, this is it. And trust me, it smells divine. It smells so good. Otherwise, I wouldn't spend another $45 for another bottle. Trust and believe. <sighs> I can smell it now and it smells so delicious. So I also got the Bobbi Brown, which I did not get from Sephora. And I got this for 10% off. And this went for $49 on the site that I was on. Let's see if that shows up better. So the Bobby Brown. No. I don't think I got too close to my color as much as I thought I would. Yeah, this is too light. But I can make it work. You see that? So I headed over to um, Morphe's and I picked up the Jeffrey Star palette. 
this was um i think it was 85 dollars i'm not for sure but this is what it looks like in the inside as you can see it's velvet filling the texture of velvet but i doubt it that it is because i think he's um for animal rights because he has a bunch of little um pomeranians are they there's a bunch of them bunch of dogs rather and so this is what this looks like look at that isn't that gorgeous i'm saying that about all of them aren't they gorgeous they're pretty to me otherwise i would never bought them <laughs> so i picked up some of his straws So these are the metal straws and they were $19.99, 10% off. I think that's what I did. I used the Jeffrey's um, code. It's J star, J S T A R R. And it's 10% off. So, but it's only for his stuff. So I picked up the straws cause I've been wanting them and they finally came back um, in order inventory rather so I picked me up some so then I turned around and picked up the Jaclyn Hill palette the volume 2 like I said when I finally did go shopping I dropped a lot of money I mean a lot of money and I don't care to really keep count of how much money I spent so I spent a lot of money so this is the Jaclyn Hill palette number 2 so let's open this up. Ah, huh, I thought this would have at least have a mirror. Guess not. And that's what it looks like. So let's see if I can get them all in there. All right, well that does it for my haul and my little gifties to myself. So i like to thank you for watching. If you're watching during the morning, good at morning, good afternoon, or good night. Depends on when you're watching this. God bless and be safe with this coronavirus.